Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Digimon World Data Squad. It's me, Cooper, and today we are going to do a battle. Battle drive immediately. Now, we are we are going to go ahead and get uh, through this forest area. Uh, last episode, we collected a bunch of treasures, and we grinded up our Digimon to their new forms like Sunfloramon. You only want to use Smiley Slap, really, huh? Alright, well, screw it. If that's what you like, go ahead and do it. Sunshine Bazooka, never mind, you chose a different move. And that's a new one, too, 145. Eh, your damage was never that high, but then we got Vmon. Oh, well, Vmon's slow. Funny enough, Vmon is like the fastest po uh, Digimon in Digimon World 4, so seeing them slow here kind of throws me off. Never thought a plant would outspeed it. Oh, we're taking, like, no damage, though, so it's not like it matters. Uh, Vmon, do you want to show us your power? Yeah, let's see your power. I just noticed our Sunflormon is, uh, uh, it now it's, uh, what is it called? Its emotion is strong now. That is with the emotion it's feeling. We also want to try and collect 40 Digi Eggs, because if we can collect 40 Digi Eggs, we should be in the clear. So now let's see that smiley slap. No, another Sunshine Bazooka. All right. Fine by me. I was getting a little tired of you slapping everybody to death. It was a little bit brutal. So we've taken care of these enemies, and now it's time to continue on. We're almost to the point where uh, good old Vmon will level up, but currently, no. Currently, no. We need to fight more Digimon first. All right, so we're going to go back to that area with uh, with the two gates, and this time we're going to activate both of them. That way, because, you know, red and blue make purple, so that'll open up the purple gate. Last episode was more of a collect-a-thon. This episode's going to be all about them gates. Crap. <laughs> ah, crap. Alright, Battle Drive. Where are we going? To fight. Oh, we're going to fight two Yanmamons and a Panamon. Luckily, we got a surprise attack, which I've realized is good. And we are going to use that surprise attack to try and deal with one of the Yanmamons before they get off an attack. Sunshine Bazooka. 175. That's better. That's better. I like it. Vimon, how you feeling? You feeling punchy? You feel like you want to punch somebody? Finish off that Yanmamon. There you go. I should have given you the other Yanmamon, but at the same time, I don't care. You'll be fine. Alright. Now, the other Yanmamon's a threat, but I want you to deal with Panamon. See if you can get a one-shot. Sunshine. That's the only move you want to use now, huh? That's fine by me. Hey, we got a... Whoa! <laughs> that damage. We got a one-shot. 418 damage. Alright, Yamamon, don't use Thunder Ray. Dang it. Alright, it's using its stronger attack. Ooh, some Flormon... Okay, didn't even take much damage, but the way they reacted to the attack was interesting. And both my Digimon are feeling pretty strong, though. So, Vimon, let's see if you can one-shot a Yamamon. Yeah! Rapid fire! <laughs> Double barrel! It's like the four kids version of freaking One Piece. Uh, freaking Luffy's attacks. Hey, good old Ag well, Agumon slash Vimon got a, a new level. I don't know if that means we got a new evolution, but a new level is always good. That is good. So for now, we are going to go over here, I believe. Yes, over to this area. And the red gate should still be open based on what I did earlier. Let's see. Yeah, it's still open. And we're going to walk in here. We're going to open up the blue gate. Ah, Patamons. And a surprise attack. You got to love that. All right. Since we got a surprise attack, we're actually going to heal. Just, uh, let's see. You know, heal Vmon. Vmon's a baby. You're a big, you're a big girl. You're pretty strong, some Flormon. And then Vimon gets to go in and get a murder. Alright, Vimon, I don't actually care what you do, as long as you finish off the Digimon in one hit. I wonder if we're gonna get a Patamon eventually. I know a lot of you guys out there like Patamon, and I do too, because I enjoy Andromon. But it's not in my top five. Not even might not even be in my top ten of all rookie Digimon. And I know that sounds bad, but there's like what, like a hundred something rookie Digimon, so you know, even being top twenty is pretty impressive. Aw, my bazooka's too strong. Those pure Patamons. 
Okay, we keep we keep getting a lot of experience, but I don't I don't know if I need to grind this much. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to walk here. I'm walking here, and the enemies keep jumping me. I need to find a repel, something that uh, gives me a little break. Did I just instantly get into a battle? No. Okay, cutscene. I don't know. Yeah, your voice actor is really weird, Lalamon. Like, I feel bad for them, because doing that voice must suck. Yeah, what's up, Yoshino? Missing children? Uh-oh. Did they mis disappear from a pizzeria? Exactly five? Because we got a problem. I saw a kid get kidnapped. It was two demi Devimons. Oh, boy. Oh no, they were taken. I saw the cutscene. Yeah, children in the digital world will get devoured. We keep an eye out for the missing children. Yeah, we better do that. Now let's look for Tom Thomas is not a missing child, but we'll also look for Thomas. Alright, let's uh, activate one of these babies. Ah, crap. The gate has been closed. But, by doing this, the other gate should be open. What's going on here? I got worried because of the I got worried because the screen was all blacked out. And by doing that, the purple gate has opened. Oh, it had to load that whole area just to show us that, didn't it? Alright, well. Well, sadly we have to use the red gate. And that's gonna close the purple gate. Oh my god, we have to Oh god, we have to watch the whole cutscene. My god. Video game, what were you thinking? Although I do appreciate they show you that the purple gate gets closed. Because if you had to walk all the way over there just to figure that out, it would suck. But uh, we know where there's another red gate. Another red circular orb that we can press. So we'll use that. So this is probably where we're supposed to get the items, but screw it. We already got those items. Battle drive. I'm really feeling it. Alright, who are we fighting this time? As long as it's not Woodmon. Woodmon wrecked our Vmon. And as strong as some Floormon is, I don't think they're very tanky at the moment. Their HP stat's a little low. All twos. There's the Smiley Slap. And it's starting to instantly kill enemies. I like that. These level ups are coming in handy. Vmon, do you want to show off your pet? No, Patamon's faster. Got it. I think that's a very weak move, but he got a crit. Even a crit was weaker than Boom Bubble. Okay. Sucks that I got a crit, but at the same time, we took that like a champ. Why don't you finish off this Patamon with one of them gyro punches? Vimon is adorable. <laughs> Anytime I see that attack, it reminds me of Agumon in the cutscenes, and it just makes me happy. Who's next? Yeah, who's next on our list of destructing? Destructing? Destroying. Who shall we destroy? Please no Woodmons, though. I will do my best to avoid the Woodmons. They will sap my HP and make me feel bad. Alright, so let's just continue on over here. Hope that we don't get jumped. Okay, yo, hey! Director, do you see me? I'm in danger, save me! The director was on screen when I got hit, uh, stuck in this battle. Oh, never mind, director. It's two Patamons, we're cool. Watch this, I'm gonna kill two Digimon in front of you. I need their Digi-Eggs. I'm gonna trade them in for some uh, items. Sunshine Bazooka. Oh yeah, that bazooka is really strong. The smiley slap sucks, but the bazooka, uh, that that's good. You jerk, don't use boom bubble. Okay, wing slap, I don't care. That does like no damage. The boom bubble is the one where it's like, ah, signature move, not bad. And Vmon, you can do whatever you want. You're too strong for me to care. Even for a little rookie like you, I feel, I feel confident in, uh, confident just letting you do what you want. I'm mostly just pressing X. I haven't been choosing the moves for them because I like to, I like to let them do what they like. Once we get to harder fights, I'll start choosing the moves myself. All right. Hey there, boss man. Goodbye, boss man. Oh, I bet you the second I press this red gate over here, we're going to have to watch that dumb cutscene with the purple gate. Which, if I was a kid, would make... Well, when I was a kid, it made me very happy. But, uh, because it's like, oh, I did it, I solved the puzzle. But as an adult, it's just like, come on, we've done this millions of times now. Let's not see the huge old cutscene. Okay. 
some champion level Digimon are, have come to party. And I'm not at full health. I'm not even close. Should be fine, though. Yanmaman, take this. Ah, you picked the wrong move. I guess I should have just chosen the move for you. Patamon, don't do it. Be nice. Wing slap me. Arrow slash, that's new. Uh-oh. And it was a crit. Oh! Ooh, where's the run button? <laughs> yeah, that 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 did a lot. That did a lot, 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 lot. That new move is strong. Another crit like that and we're out of here. I definitely need to invest in some healing. Maybe I should get out of this battle and just use items. Oh god, they're bullying my Vmon. Okay, Sonic Bite's not that bad. It's a weak move. Still deal a lot, though. It's putting me to a point where I could be killed. Alright, well, we should probably heal. And then let Vmon finish off that Patamon before it does another Arrow Slash. Uh-oh. Oh, good. Oh, so you're nice to some Flormon. But the second you looked at Vmon, you're like, I'm gonna murder you. There will be no survivors. Alright, go ahead and kill off Patamon. We don't want to deal with that slash move again. Ooh, headbutt. Hey, all threes. I like it. Whenever we got all the same number, I feel like a lucky guy. Alright, uh, let's just do another heal. We need the guard anyway, just to get more stats up. Go give it to yourself. You know, one's probably only going to do like 50 damage to us, so I don't really care. Oh, not to you, actually. You're tanky. And it didn't even use Thunder Ray, so eh. What a weakling. Oh, we get to heal again. Nice. This will save us some money. I'm using this battle to recover. That critical hit really uh, knocked me down a notch. Alright, uh, Vimon, you ready to do another one of them headbots or gyro punches? That seems to be all you know. I need to level you up more so you can learn more attacks. Oh, you could also one-shot the opponent. Good job. Never mind. We did that quite well. And we got a level up, but not for Agumon. For Lalamon. Alright, not bad. I'm feeling good now. More confident. Definitely more confident. Alright, let's go over here and press this bubble. Okay. The fact that it didn't cutscene to the other area worries me. That's funny. Now, I was just saying I don't want the long cutscene, and the game doesn't give me the long cutscene, and now I'm worried. <sighs> they got me. So if I remember the puzzle correctly, you just press that button, and that since it's the red one just like the other red one, it uh, should do what we want. Ooh, why is uh, our other Digimon so angry? Here, you can aim at uh, good old Gabumon. Whenever there's three opponents, I get worried. Because the three opponents, that's that's when we start taking damage. Vimon, are you faster than these guys? Okay, you're at least faster than these guys. Uh, why don't you finish off that Guru? Well, see if you could do uh, finish off that Garumon, Or if we need backup for you. Oh yeah, you can finish it by yourself. Hell yeah. Never doubt a Vimon. Little horn. Nope, horn attack, damn. It's not that strong, though. What about you? Are you gonna use little horn? Nope, another horn attack. Oh, crap. Critical hit. Okay. That became real damage. I don't want to take real damage. But I guess at the same time, it's a good thing, because then I get to heal, and then when I get to heal, I get my guard points up. Every time I get my guard points up, I get a chance for Digivolution. Alright, you finish off A Gabumon. You you use you fight B. If you can fight Guru if you can kill Gurumon in one hit, you can kill this guy in one hit. Especially with the Oh, that's the biggest number we've seen so far. Not even Creepy Bond did that much damage. Creepy Bond only did like 400. We're we're freaking strong. Now that there's two of us, I feel like we could take on Creepy Mon. I know I'm 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 talking kind of like Marcus now. Sunshine Bazooka. This is the stronger attack. And it definitely is the stronger attack. Heck yeah, look at that. For some reason you were motivated to use it and you saved us. Level up, that's what I like to see. 
Every level comes with good stuff. All right, so I press the button. That's all I know. I'm gonna see if it. Well, that thing is not open yet. If that red gate's not open, it makes me feel like I didn't press the button, and I just thought I pressed the button, and that is a that's that's scaring me a bit. No, I pressed it. There it is. It's open. All right, as long as the purple gate's open, I'm cool with it. You know, before we go in there, we should probably go talk to, uh, what's, what's their name? Salomon. And see if we got him 40 eggs yet. Also, I haven't really checked the left path. I could check the left path. Smiley slam. Give me that. Vimon, you do just as good. Just, just punch him. Use your anger. I don't know why, I don't know why you're so angry. But I'm assuming that anger makes you stronger. Easy. We got no items, though, and barely any experience. Also, the enemies don't drop a lot of bit. Maybe that's because there's a lot of enemies, but still. It makes me a little sad when we aren't getting that much money out of this. Oh, there we go. So there was a chest on this side. Another enchant. Uh, there was an area over here. Just checking it before we go to the next place. This is an uh, area we recognize, actually. We've been here before. Oh, okay. Oh, we're good. We don't need to be here anymore. So just the loop. It's a small loop. This whole area is just a small loop. Good to know. Panamons! Easy kills. Easy eggs. I wonder if he has, like, a special thing where Salomon's like, No, you need just champion level eggs. And I'm gonna be like, Damn, how many? He's like, 400. I'm like, I'm not gonna grind 400 eggs for you. Ooh, critical hit. Probably not necessary. Yeah, not even necessary. Picking Sunshine Bazooka basically guaranteed that thing's death. And Vimon, I don't care what you pick. You are you are so strong. You could pick Baby Burner and I'd still be happy. And I'd be laughing. <laughs> oh, why would you call your attack Baby Burner? That's so, that's so wrong. I love it. I need to meet the creators of this game, or the localizers of this game, and figure out what they were thinking. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. We've done everything we need to do. So we'll just head back to Salomon, and then head over through the Purple Gate, and see if we have a whole new area to explore, or if that's the end of this area. Given that this is the first real area in the game, I could see it being the end of the area. Oh, just a Yamamon by itself? I guess this is the first area, so finding a champion... Like, the first area of this area... Okay. No, I'm starting to... I'm not making sense. Since this is where we spawned, they don't want to spawn the stronger enemies just in this area. So they're not going to spawn two of them with a, bu with a buddy like they do in the other place. Thinking that we're still weak. But since we've grinded up like a ton, we're actually fine. We could take on the whole world right about now. Like I said, where's that creepy mon? I'll give him what for with my V-mon. Even though Geo Greymon couldn't handle it. I'm starting to think I'm not a very good tamer. Wait, I don't think this is the right way. I think this is the right way. Damn it. I gotta memorize these maps. It's been a while since I've played this game from my childhood. So I gotta I gotta get my memories back. Hey! The only good thing about keep running that we keep running into these guys is I think you have to fight champion Digimon to also get a Digio Evolution. So every time we kill a champion Digimon, we get a higher chance of Digivolving. 304, heck yeah. And you know me, guys, I'd love a Digivolution. That was a waste of time. Did she just say that? She she was right, but damn. You just murdered one of your own kind. Reverted them back into an egg. Proved the idea of reincarnation for crying out loud. Alright. Hey, there's no way I haven't gotten 40 eggs by now. That's right. What do I get? A holy ring. Cool. Do I get anything else? Next time I'd like 70. Did I get 70? Ah, oh, yeah. I didn't get 70. Okay. I'll, I'll let you know when I get 70 eggs. I got a holy ring, though. That's kind of cool. Wasn't Weren't they just talking about the holy ring? 
Eh, either way. Let's get over to this new purple area. I'm sure there's plenty of... It looks like there's something up there. Like, I keep seeing this little, little shiny thing up there. It makes me think it's an item. Oh, look, another champion. It's sad that it's going to be a weak enemy that we're going to murder. But... Oh! <gasps> Digi-Soul Charge! Oh, crap! Okay, wait a minute. Evolution time. Digi-Soul. Digivolve 2. So what are you going to become? Have we fought enough champions now, or do you just have a new form? All right. Oh, a smaller... Oh! We got the Holy Ring, so we got Salomon. She becomes the Salomon. Lalamon becomes Salomon. Okay. Well, Salomon has an awesome Digivolution route, so that's cool. Uh, it's really weak, though. Like, extremely weak. It has the word puppy... It has Petite Punch and Puppy Howl. That's adorable. That's adorable. Petite Punch. Yes. It did no damage. Oh, God. We should not be using Salomon. We need to switch partners immediately. And I think I might as well show you guys how. Yeah, don't worry. Vemon's still, like, packing a punch. It's just problematic that uh, Salomon... We just got you, I'd say, at the worst possible time. Because where we're going, we don't want a Salomon. I'm not saying I don't like Salomon. I really do. Especially their evolved forms. Heck yeah. It looks like there's something up there, right? Okay, let me... Before we continue on, let me just check. Is there a way back there? Ah, oh, ha, ha, ha. That's how you do it. KHP charge. That's a really good one. Ah, I, didn't for I forgot to see if I can change Salomon's evolution. Eh, it doesn't matter. Salomon, even by itself, will be fine because Vmon will carry it. Hmm. Two enemies, though. All right, Salomon. You're feeling strong right now? That's good. That's good. I want to see your puppy howling. Show me the puppy howling and do it to Patamon. Oh, that move is actually pretty decent. Okay. Your petite punch is complete ass, but that move... Oh, and you're fast enough to go twice for some reason. Reason. Let's let's howl again. Let's see if you can kill a Gabumon. Inflict free... It also inflicts freeze, apparently. The howling can do freezing. Oh, well, we didn't kill him, so I'm glad we inflicted freeze. Although, Vimon's just gonna kill him. Vimon, you may punch. I'm guessing freeze is like paralyzed, where like you lose a turn or something, or you have a chance of losing a turn. Either way, Salomon's looking a little better. It's just the petite punch that sucks. I don't know. Maybe it's more than that. I, I'm just making stuff up at this point. There's a possibility it's it's not just the petite punch that sucks. All right, let's go over here. Oh, whoops. I'm taking a long way, but I'm taking the way. And now we know it's right there. There's the thing. Uh, let me see if there's a way to do it, because I it's been a little, while, a little while since I've done this. Check status. I think it's evolution map, but we're going to check status. Status. Let's see. You got Vmon head. Critical damage. Its ability is critical damage up. That's interesting. What's Lalamon's? Escape up. Increased chance of escaping. Agility plus 50. Wow. That's why you're so fast. And support. Decrease tension. Increase sympathy. Decrease sympathy. So I could really anger my, my Digimon. And Salomon, it's got look around, recover up, increase, uh, resist, resist a champion Digimon. Got a lot of interesting moves. I'm glad I looked at this just to see what they can do. Uh, let's look at our evolution map. Now this is really interesting in this game. Because every Digimon gets like a whole little freaking solar system, as we will see in a few seconds. The Agumon Galaxy. With the Agumon Galaxy, we could see Agumon's evolutionary routes. So, right now we're a Vmon. Ooh, this is an unknown still, even though it looks like Greymon to me. Uh, what's our stats at? We're at 159 strength. How much do we need for this? We can look at our requirements right here. Strength is at least 270. Everything else is good. We just need strength at 270, which we are not even close to. Uh, we got Greymon, and... Ooh, you're great. Ooh, your ultimate form looks awesome. Attack commands 100 times, levels at least 15. Inflicted a thousand damage. Oh, we did do that. Uh, open 15 treasure chests, encounter 50 enemies, defeat 5 DR Digimon. Well, 
that's interesting, at least. Alright. And right now we're... Oh, wait, we have Guillemon. What does Guillemon have the chance to become? HP is at least 400. That's hard to make. Yeah, HP at 400 would be hard. We're actually... Oh, we're, like, right there. At, we're, like, really close. And Vmon doesn't have any evolution, sadly. It's just its own little thing. So I guess they cheaped out on Vmon. Plus six Digivolve to DR Digimon. I'm guessing that means dragons. All right, well, obviously our strongest thing would be him. So we're gonna go to Digivolve to Geogreymon. Because I believe we're going up to a boss fight and we want to have that. Oh, Lollamon's Galaxy looks cute. So we have Sunflormon. I was right about the name, thank God. Well, I guess I used, added R to it, but it, whatever. Let's see what else you can become. You got Palmon, Guard Command, 15 times open 10 plus treasure chests. Oh, that's a little bit tough. I'm, get, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. We got the puppy. Puppy can become this thing. Holy shit. Okay, well, that ain't happening anytime soon. Salomon has some um, hard evolutions. Now, we all know what that is. Defeated five NSO Digimon. Need to figure out what these mean. I'm guessing it's types, right? It's just types. Well, we'll eventually get there. And then we got some Flormon in order to get your evolution, which is really cool. We need intelligence at an insane amount. 15 ME Digimon. Support command 10 times. Support command? Ah, support sucks. For, to, I hate using support command. But just in case, we're going to use some Flormon. After this, I can go back to Salomon and stuff. But just in case the boss fight's like right here, I want to be ready. I think, I'm, I think it's fair to, to want to be prepared. And I've been doing a lot of grinding in these uh, first two episodes. Well, I guess it was the third episode. First three episodes. So I think it's about time we had another boss fight. Where, who do we come here to look for again? Oh, look. it's to Oh, Bakemon. I forgot. How's Bakemon looking in this game? That's a Bakemon. I like it. Good, good. Bakemon. Thomas, you look all right. You're not, you know. Don't seem like a loser, at least. Did you literally just beat Bakemon by yourself? Never mind, I don't think I need Tom. I don't like Thomas. Oh, he's the nerd? But he memorized the whole... Th oh, yeah, they said he was a genius, right? Oh, he's got Galmon. That's really cool. Yeah, Galmon. Uh, people like Galmon. It's either Galmon or Gabumon. Who do you like more? Do you like the pupper with uh, boxing gloves or do you like the, the wolf puppy? That, uh, that is Gabumon. That's wearing, like, a hoodie. Sir, yes, sir. All right, so they're... Hey, don't just ignore me. These are Commander Samson's orders. The three of us are supposed to work... Yeah, Yoshino, I, I like you. you. You're following orders. And they're actually understandable orders. So we got Thomas to join the team. So forcefully, we're not going to let Thomas do this fight alone. Besides, it's just a Bakemon. Now, granted, it's, it's an interesting champion. It might have special abilities, but... Our Digimon are extremely strong. Like, unbelievably strong. So let's see how this boss fight goes. Some Flormon and... Oh, I forgot to heal. Some Flormon, it makes sense that you're the fastest. Uh, you could use Sunshine Bazooka. This is your strongest move. I just want to see how much damage we do before I get to healing. Should have healed before the fight, though. That's on me. That was a crate for 600 damage, which means this thing's tankier than we thought. All right, Bakemon. Actually, we did most of its health in that one hit. Dark Hand. Uh-oh. Ooh, that looks cool. 52 damage. Oh, okay. We can take it. Granted, a crit would have been scary, but that, that, that's fine. We have a Digi-Soul charge. Why do we have a Digi-Soul charge? We just checked our map. I don't have any of these. Do I? Oh, wait, but we get to punch the enemy Digimon when we do this. It's 100% worth it. And we get a full heal. Yeah, that's the one thing I like about you, Marcus. You'll freaking almost a hundred damage. Nice. You'll just freaking punch your Digimon to, in order to get that Digivolution. Everyone else, some just takes the soul from a distance. Although I guess we haven't seen Thomas, but you, you're just like, uh, uh. He's gonna get it. He's gonna get it. One good punch to the noggin. All right, what the hell is Geogramon gonna evolve into? Oh, is that Growlmon? It's so much smaller than Geogramon. But it is a champion level Digimon. Oh, our HP, our HP is above 400, isn't it? 
All right, well, we have a Grelmon now. Cool. Grelmon, what are your moves? I'll let you decide. What do you like to do? Bakemon, take this. Growlclaw. 400 damage. Holy crap. Yeah. All right, little guy. You ready to do whatever you want? Because honestly, this thing's almost dead already. Bakemon, get a little bit of this. Rolling up a. I know rolling kick from uh, Pokemon, but a rolling uppercut, that sounds cool. It's like they mixed rolling kick with sky uppercut. Alright, so I could try to finish this thing off now with a sunshine bazooka. Or I could go for a heal, which uh, I think is a better idea. Yeah. We haven't done 15 guard commands after all, so we gotta do it. I feel like we have, but the game's, the game's calling, my, calling my bluff. Alright, your dark hand attack is cool. Like, it looks really cool. But, oh, it actually did a lot of damage. Okay. You would think that uh, Mr. Grelmon here would have some darkness resistance, given that it is a freaking, uh, well, it has a lot of dark evolutions. Growlclaw at 400. Oh, about 400, but uh, you didn't fall. That's weird. I thought that would be the move that killed it. All right, let's see how much health it has. Barely any. Come on. Give him one of them rolling uppers. Or wild echoes, sure. He lived? Or did it? Okay, I was gonna say, or did it? It's like it's like looking down. We got an intelligence chip. That's good. Intelligence is important. We can give that to Lalamon since Lalamon has needs a lot of intelligence to get to her ultimate form. Pokemon. We got him. Our team is so strong. Good thing I didn't come in here with rookies. What's wrong, Thomas? I think Digivolving? Digivolving? What the hell is Bakemon's evolve for? Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, God. This is our first ultimate level Digimon, Myotismon. And it used Grizzly Wing. Those are not the team members we're looking, uh, we're using at the moment. Much more powerful than before. How the hell? It must have blasted Digivolved. I'm talking Digimon World 3 stuff. Uh, guys, I don't know if we can fight a Myotismon. That's an ultimate level. Attacks with VB attributes. Virus busters are effective on Myotismon. Virus bu- They're called- VBs are virus busters. Who are you? It doesn't matter. You need to concentrate on defeating Myotismon. Alright, so we need to use attacks with those VB busters. Myotismon's attributes are NSO. Nightmare, Nightmare soldiers. That's what NSO means. So his weakness is VB attributes. So we should use the move. Oh, oh, we've been collecting items that are called VB Enchant. So let's do this. Okay, we can do this, guys. And we've been needing to use our support anyway because we don't we don't use support enough, especially if we want to get Lalamon to evolve. Okay, so Myotismon, ultimate level Digimon. It's known as a Nightmare Soldier, and so we uh, want to use Virus Busters to destroy. Oh God, it's going after me immediately. Bloody Punch. That's a cool. That's a cool name for our Blood Punch. Either way, that's a cool name for a move. All right, I need your help. I need you to support. Uh, all that is good. All of these are good. I like it, but we need an item. All right. Uh, no, 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 no. We're looking for enchant and battle type item. VB enchant. Yep, we've been doing this. Give it to Growlmon. That's our hit heaviest hitter. Okay, we got virus busters. Okay. Grandmon's now ready to do some damage. Alright, Grandmon, how you feeling? You in the mood? Oh, yeah, you are. I would love to see a different move from you, so I'm actually going to choose it myself. Let's see what a Plasma Blade can do. It sounds really cool, honestly. Plasma Blade! 654 damage. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, buddy. You have a Digivolution! Oh, crap! Oh, perfect timing. We are going to Digivolve, everybody. Gaumon, Digivolve. To oh yeah, how do you do? Do you punch the enemy? Please tell me you punch the enemy. Why is the main character the only cool one that like? I know I said I don't like him because I don't like it. I don't like a lot about him, but there's some things I do like. He's willing to straight up one v one a freaking Digimon, punch it in the face. All right, are you gonna get uh, your natural evolution? We going for like uh, Galgamon? That looks like Galgamon to me. 
All right, now we got Big Pupper. And with this dog, we can win. However, we do want to uh, keep our enchants up. So I need you to enchant yourself, because we're gonna let we're not gonna allow uh, what is it called? We're not gonna allow some Floramon to attack yet. Not until we need it. You enchant yourself. Get that virus buster on you. Use this. And then we'll leave some Floramon to heal. Or use items. Okay, here we go. Blood punch. Over a hundred damage. It is an ultimate level Digimon, so it makes sense. As long as it doesn't use Grizzly... Wow, you're fast. You are fast to be going again. All right, let's see what your new attacks can do. Ooh, he's a biter. 478. Not as good as Growlmon, but you know what? Still really powerful. All right, now you... Let's actually use a support item heal. Because you're a little lower than I like to see. Yeah, you... Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up, hold up. We only have one of those? Sorry. Do we really only have one of these items? No, wait. All allies. That's why we only have one of those. This is the one I wanted to use. Yeah, use it on yourself. That way you can start using heals. Restore 500 HP. Okay, use this. Nice. Ramon, do you want to take a smack at him? Alright. I'll let you do your own attack this time. Your last one did like 650. Growl Claw. 748. Wow. Plasma Blade was weaker. I find that to be impossible. Alright, let's go ahead and let you do your thing. Try that Double Claw. I haven't seen it yet. No, nope, Galga Hound it is. We shall bite. This Myotismon is still standing. That worries me a bit. He's about to die, though. Still sticking to Blood Punch. He's not using Grizzly Wing. I like it. That gives us a huge chance of winning this battle. In fact, screw it. Some Flormon you want to murder? What's your best move? Sunshine Bazooka, right? It's over here. Use the Sunshine Bazooka. Finish this fight off. I know he's an ultimate, and I know you haven't been enchanted, but this should still hurt. Yeah! Go, Sunflormon! Our Digimon are freaking awesome! Holy crap. We got good level ups. We have a Galgamon now. We have a freaking... Uh, Sunflamon, we got everything. Yeah. Good thing we were told about that weakness. I have no idea, but I, I I thank them. What's wrong, sir? So Thomas is the brainy type, as we thought, because he was he he was told to be a genius. All right, so let's see. What are we gonna do? We'll it, so wait right All right, you retrieve the digi egg. I'm gonna. I, I deserve a promotion for being so awesome. I mean, I did do all the work, right? Is that? Is that? Can we put that in the report? Good Thank job. you, sir. Oh, okay. New character. Or not. Okay, there we go. Alright, who do you know, Thomas? Thomas long time no Kagura. Alright, hello. Thomas, who yeah, who is this? Nice to meet you, and Damon. Okay, don't say full names. It's weird. This is Tsukasa, Kagura. Tsukasa Kagura. Okay. He's been transferred to the Dats, Japan, as of today. And where is he from? I look forward to working with you. And what's he do? What is he? I need to know. Oh, he's also Brainy Bunch. Okay, he's part of the Brainy Bunch. I was his senior, but I'm no match for Thomas. Oh, really? Thomas is a genius that graduated at the head of his class when he was... Oh, go f*** yourself, Thomas. So what's someone like you? Why is Thomas doing this? Why isn't he building shit? Does the dark area have something to do with these strange... Oh, God, the dark area. Of course, the, the, the this is there's something called the dark area. It's a dark area in the digital world. An area that hasn't been analyzed. Oh, you just mean, like, an area, an undiscovered area. You know what? I'm with Thomas on that one. He shouldn't have to explain something that doesn't exist. Wait a second. Are you saying I'm not smart enough to 
he might be right, Marcus. Now, now. Anyway, it appears that the whole digital world is affected when the dark area becomes active. It would seem that the strange occurrences in the digital world are connected to the real world. Oh, okay. So the dark area has something to do with the missing children and the Digimon becoming wild? I've been called in to investigate since I'm an expert on the dark area. Interesting. Yeah, we get it. Well, maybe, Marcus, maybe. Okay, you can stop talking now. I like Yoshino. I really do. Oh, don't worry about that, guys. I, I have to have that alarm on. But yeah, okay, I'm really liking this. Oh, what the? You went missing. I watched you get I watched you get kidnapped. Oh, crap, that's your si your old. She was talking about her older brother. She meant this guy. So you're the guy with Renamon, then. Interesting. Well, then you better give us all the help you can. In fact, why don't you just give us infinite money? That way we can buy what we need. Don't worry about the race cars. That's just how my street. Oh, crap. Creepymon. All right, guys, we're going to be digital diving. And, but we're going to be digital diving next time. I want to thank you all for watching. We are going into a more interesting part of the game. Now that we've known, understand the stakes of children being missing. It is our, it, our one of our character's sisters. Uh, we need to go and do that. But first, we need to think about what we're going to do with our Digivolutions. I'm kind of excited for all that. At the end of the day, though, we got a great team. We got a great game. And I want to thank you all for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe, and uh, see you next time.